Hey everyone, it's Nana for Fun, back I think for episode 14 of um, Breath of the Wild on the Switch. Uh, you'll have to forgive me because we did Skyward Sword recently, so when I go to play this today, I may get some of the controls wrong because they're not the same at all on this. So um, without further ado, I think we left off looking at doing some towers. So let's go. Hopefully I have sound. Oh, I do have sound. Not a lot, but we do. So where am I? Ah, right. I was going to, that's right, I had marked that tower. So now, I wanted to see if there's anything close to it. No, I have nothing close to it. So this means I'm going to have to travel to get there. All right. That's okay. Tamsin can always make me go faster. That's a cool thing about this. She can just zip me along, and it's cool. Ooh, where am I here? I've forgotten this area. Oh, you know where we are? We're close to the Colosseum. Ooh. Hmm. Well, we won't do that now, but we'll come back here because there's a way, like, I do the Colosseum totally different from anyone else. I do not attack the, uh, oh, come on, get up there. Come on, dude, get up there. How come I don't got a balloon? Did I already kill this guy? Hmm. Oh, wait a minute. I have to go this way. Oh, right. It's nuts. Sorry. <laughs> oh, no, 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 don't want that. I'm going to blow the nuts up. That would be bad. All right, let's see. Where are we going here? Okay, right there. Ha ha, got that one. And that one drops right since I'm here. Let's see, right there, okay. Ha ha, yes! Ha ha ha! Woohoo, so we've done that. And I don't want to go to the Coliseum yet. I'm headed for, I'm hitting the wrong button. Sorry guys. I'm going to, nope, I want to go this way. So I'm going to fly across and then run up over that way. All right. So, yeah, I keep forgetting which ones are which because for Skyward Sword, they're totally different. And I get it wrong. So I will apologize now for the mistakes I'm about to make. When you play Skyward Sword and then swap over to this, it's not easy. I'm trying to get there before it gets dark. I don't really like traveling the fields in the dark. Number one, I don't see the big walkers really easily. So I'm pretty pathetic at it. And, oh look, a little boat. There must be a chest or something in the stream. <gasps> you rotten thing, you! I'm going to hit you. Whoa, you got me, you rotter. Oh my goodness! What is it with all these things? <laughs> I got you away from you, though. So now i got to remember how I, how I used to do this. Ah, all right. Just remembering which buttons to hit where. I'm beeping. Oh, bleep, 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 bleep. Which direction? Oh, that way. Oh. oh, bad guys, bad guys. Really big bad guys. Ooh, where did they come from? I don't remember those guys over here, the moblins. So I'm going to go up the hill so they don't follow me. Hmm, I don't remember seeing big moblins. Oh, good heavens, dude. Come on, walk, run faster. It takes a while to get across. Where are we now? We are going in that direction. All right. And we'll climb the side here so that if there are any moblins, they don't see me. I'm sure there probably are. I can hear snuffling, so... Yeah, down there. See, there's moblins. I cheated. Oh, look! It's an apple person. 
So, oh no, I know what I can hear. I know what I hear. I hear one of those big, uh, what are they called? The one-eyed dudes. Um, can't remember what they're called, but I can hear them. So I'm guessing one of them is around sleeping because they snore. Woohoo! Yeah! Yeah, ha ha! I'll take it. Oh, wait a minute. Wrong thing. I'm using the wrong thing. <laughs> I'm using the wrong thingy to, to try. I was trying to fight with the stick and not with the, with the sword. Whoops. All right. So where am I? This is, which one is this? Oh, this is the one. What is this one? Um, oh, right. Okay. I think I remember this one. Maybe not. Maybe not. Oh, yeah. It is this one, too. I gotta go over here. Alright. I know what I'm doing. Ooh, itchy nose. A little bit of allergy stuff today, I think. But, yeah. I gotta come in and around and behind the big bad guys. And I gotta avoid the walkers, who are evil, I might add, because I die a lot with the walkers. What the heck? How is he finding me? Like, this is not... What the heck? I thought I was far enough away. That's weird. Oh, wrong one. How did he manage to see me from all the way down there? All right, so we're gonna come this way. I'm not really thrilled with it being coming up nighttime. Well, it's only 1.30. I guess it's just dark because it's cloudy, maybe? Ah, good, I got a darner. All right, so we're gonna kill this dude first. Come up behind him. Come around. There we go. Into the eye. Just do it and just keep doing it till you hit him enough times that you kill him. I don't know how many. Oh, I'm still going. Because it's because I got this little wimpy uh, uh, bow. That's why. I'm using up a little wimpy bow so it takes longer to kill these guys when that happens. Yeah, there we go. First guy down. I don't find it exciting to die a lot in this game, so I've found ways around that. It's more fun to try and think your way through and not get killed. At least I find it that way. Hello, little fox. I won't kill you today. Not in the mood. All right. So now we're going up here and we're going to kill the next one. There we go. I know it's not really an exciting way to do it, because I know a lot of people, they get up there and they fight and they do all these things. But I find it much better to do it this way. Like, you don't have to kill yourself, you don't have to... Like, with these guys anyways. And once you're in the castle, it's it's a lot tougher. Because the castle, you got quite a few... Oh dear, my falcon bow is dying. But that's okay. Oh! Cool. I'll swap out my falcon bow before I do the next one. And I need all this stuff anyways for what upgrading. So let's be honest, the best way to do this is to have upgraded stuff. And I really don't want to do this at night because you get a bunch of freaking... Um, you get skeletons coming up while you're trying to kill the guy. And it's really hard to do because you're fighting skeletons and the guy's trying to shoot you. And yeah, I've done that before. It is not pretty. Hello, dear. Oh, I missed you because I 
use the wrong thing, take out a sword. Where is he? Where'd she go? What? Whoa, who's, oh, he saw me. Little Rodder, eh? Little Rodder saw me. All right, we'll go this way. <laughs> there we are. So now I'm gonna change my bow because my other bow is dying and in the middle of shooting this thing, I'll uh, end up killing myself. I think I'll use that one. Yeah. All right. There we are. Yeah, see, it shoots a little better. It kills them a little faster if you've got a better bow. If you've got a really high-level bow, you can kill these guys super fast. But, and yeah, you can use the electric things, but these work just as well. The electric bows work, like the electric arrows work just great, but I only have so many of those at the beginning of a game, so I try not to. Now, with this, you got to be careful because there are walkers around here. So you gotta be careful which side you, you climb up, honestly. As I recall, uh, before I go too far, I will put on my climbing hat. Just a little faster is all. But yeah, you gotta be super careful because the walkers see you. When you see him over there, you gotta stay on the side where he can't see you which is not always that simple. And I'm just gonna duck down for, oh, he's going the other way, okay. Oh, wrong way, okay. So, we're gonna do that. Because once he starts walking away, you're in a better shape. But, I've had them shoot me as high as this. So, you gotta really be careful on this tower. Because I've been pretty high up and they, uh, they shoot you. And I've done this where I've jumped around and uh, missed. Fallen to the bottom and then been shot by the guys. So, eh. That was a learning experience, I tell ya. However, we made it this time to get Central Tower. So, here we go. My cat's going nuts here today. It's running around like a crazy thing. Lay down, cat. It's <laughs> being a bit nuts. I got the tower! Woohoo! This is one of the harder ones, and the other hard one is it's got a moat around it, and you kind of have to come down and fly in, and you end up coming in low, and the zapper guys are trying to get you, and there's Lizolfos in the river, and it's not fun. So I found a way to fly in, and you fly in and just kind of scoot over top of them all. So, but it's not easy. Look at that, we've got the tower, we've got the map. All right, so we've got this one. So what I wanna do while I'm here is, right, I gotta go to this, right, and over to the camera. And then what I wanna do is take a picture, if I could zoom in, on him. Because later on, I need that. Yep. There we are. So later on, I need a picture of him. So I'll get it now, then I'll use it later. Now the question is, where does I want to go? We wanted to go back to the Colosseum, I think, and, and I'll show you what I do to get the uh, dude. But is there, where is the, where is that one? Right, those are the towers I haven't got yet. So. Those are to the west, which is that way, I believe. So we'll wait on the Colosseum. 
but I think I'm going to fly to the west and see what I can... Oh, there's a tower. Aha! What tower? Oh, that's, uh, that's quite a ways out there. All right. So, I'm sh oh, there's another one. Oops, wrong one. Uh-oh, I got to get rid of one of my colored ones to my colory things. You know what? I know where that is, so that's all right. I don't need to. So which tower to go to? I think that one. Yeah. So we're going to try and get away from the walkers in here. I hope I can. I hope, I hope, I hope. Oh, there's a shrine nearby. Cool. So we'll just get this and we'll change into the uh, this thing because once night comes, you run faster in this outfit. So because I think I upgraded it, I think. All right. So I hear there was a where did it go? Where did it go? Oh, over this way. Oh, over here. I hear a bleep bleep bleep. Bleep bleep. Oh, all right. I'm doing the bleep bleep. Let's go find a shrine. Then we'll head for that tower. Be pretty easy to see in the dark. Um. All right. Crazy, crazy. Oh yeah. But I already got. What is that? Oh right, that's the Colosseum. That's not the one I want. Well, where's the shrine that keeps beeping? That's weird. Oh. What the? Oh. Whoa! Right. <laughs> I used the right sword button. Hmm. I don't know what. What's bleeping? Hmm. Over this way? What shrine is beeping? I can hear those guys. I hear a shrine beeping. I'm going that direction. Oh! There's the shrine! Well, go figure. It was hidden down in a ditch. Alright, I can find that. No problem. Calm your tack, Shrunt. Calm your tack, huh? I'm going to calm my tack. Alright. Calm your tack. In we go. Boop, boop. I have no idea. Like I said, most of these I don't remember doing. So it's not that easy because I'll go in and go... Oh crap, how do I do this one now? Oh man. Calm your attack. This is the dude from... Co oh. Oh, look at this. I forget this one. To you who sets foot in the shrine, I am Calm your attack. In the name of the goddess Hylia, I offer this trial. Alright. Trial of power. Um. Let's just see. Let's try that first. Does this work? Ah, all right. I gotta get up there, obviously. Um, activate, and then what do I do with it? Pull it back and let it go. Yes. Ah, oh, all right. Whoa, just about hit me. Oh, okay, uh, right. There. Activated. Let go. Alright. How about these ones? Oh. oh, it stopped them. But it didn't. It didn't stop. I gotta stop them. There. There. Stop them there. All right. No, 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 no rolling. No, no rolling. Stop that. Stop it. How am I supposed to get through this? Not like that. All right, so. I will run through because that's going to start rolling again. Whoa, and there's some bad guys. Whoa! 
Alright. Whew. Okay. That was a lot of little guys. There's only two, but it felt like a lot. Um, what do we got here? Guardian sword. Oh, that's a better sword. So let's just take a look. What have I got here that I can ditch? Well, we will ditch that because that is lousy and this is good. Yes? Yeah, that's better. A 20 sword is better than a 10 thing any day. And that is also a better one. So we will drop that and pick that up. Cool. And now, oh, all right. No, all right, let's do this. Uh, we have to set fire to something, I think, it looks like. I get used to the whole camera thing again. It's killing me. Ma. Edge of duality. It's a 20. All right, have I got something I can ditch that's not as good? Mm. Hmm. I don't use the big swords very often. Um... I don't know. You know what? You can always get another axe because you can go to one of the places and get a big axe. And I don't really use the axes that much, so I'll take that. Um, and this rolled through here. Where am I going? Oh! Ooh, look! Another treasure chest. This one has a couple treasure chests in it. Nice! Ugh, oh, and a knight's broadsword. Again, my inventory's full. What have I got that's not... It really, it's only a... I need a pokey stick. So, you know what? I'm just going to leave it. And then I can always come back to the shrine and pick it up if I need another sword, if I'm sure. I can remember where that is. Sure I can. <laughs> sure, sure I can. Oh! Whoa! You rotter! You hit me! I don't know, that's a... That's a... a pokey stick, but it's not... Oh, it's a guardian spear, which is better than my other pokey stick by two. So I will take that pokey stick. All right. However, I don't know where I'm going. Must be over here. Yes? Maybe. All right. Oh, one of those things. I hate those things. They always tip when you run across them when you're not paying attention. Sorry guys, wrong buttons. I'm getting back used to using it again. Where am I? What am I looking at? Oh, all right. All right, I can do this. I'm just trying to figure out what I got to do. Um, oh, it's one of these things. All right. Oh. door open. Yahoo! Oh, and there's another treasure chest? Wow, this one's got like lots. There's like four? I'll take it. That's great. I need the ancient cores too because there's something I don't remember what, but I do remember I need it for something. Now where am I going? Hmm, I'd open those doors, and I'm going up these stairs. Oh, 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 oh. I can walk across the center of this without getting hurt. What is this? Uh, yeah, right. First, I gotta flame on that thing, I think. There we go. Right, and now I have to... I don't know what I have to do. 
Um, oh, okay. I think I know. All right, all right. So I gotta, first I gotta set that on to that. And then I gotta run. And hopefully, Come on, 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 come on. Oh, it worked. Holy man, but it didn't. Oh, all right. Oh, I'm smart, hey? I'm running in front of a thing that, what am I gonna do here? Oh, right. I gotta take something bigger than what I got. Uh, maybe the edge of duality will do. And I gotta, do this, yes. And then I gotta go. There. Right. Ah! Look at that! I did it. Alright. Oh! Yay! There's a bomby place. Um. Uh, throw R. Wrong way. Alright. That's okay. I only need to bomb open one side. Hey, that's like five treasures. This is great. Silver rupee. I will take it. I like this this particular uh, shrine. It's got a lot of treasure. How am I doing here? Um, oh, there's stairs there. Another treasure? Nice! Six treasures in one try? I have forgotten this one. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. All right. I can do this. So. And. Oh! I will float over to here. Yes. Right there. And get the treasure. Yep. I did it! Ooh, a diamond. I could use the money. So I still have clothing to buy. Because I haven't done the, the hot clothing yet. I gotta get that. So, let's see. So I need to turn this way. And then I need to... Uh, right. Use that. And fly into dude! Fly into dust in the wind dude. Your resourcefulness in overcoming this trial speaks to the promise of a hero. In the name of the goddess Hylia, I bestow upon you this spirit orb. Give me the orb, dude. Yes, I got another orb. May the goddess smile upon you and... <sighs> did it! Blew him away. <laughs> it blows me away, man. I need to come up with more of those stupid puns. Just can't think of any offhand. All right, so I was headed for, oh, it's, it's, what does that say, 5.58, 6 o'clock, okay. So I'm almost down to where it's too dark to be traveling around here. So what is over there? Is there anything? Oh, oh, there's some bad guys attacking some people. Oh, that's not good. We can't have that. Right. We cannot have that. No. Ah, I'll fix you. Aha. Fixed you, you dudes. How many shields have I got? Enough? I got enough clubs, but have I got a shield? All right, let's talk to this dude. Check. You got away with a sword, don't you? I'll admit I was maybe a little in over my head there. Thanks. Oh, I got tough wheat bread. Hmm, I'll get them next time for sure. And how about this dude? Dude. Thank Hylia that Mina is safe. I knew it wasn't smart to go treasure hunting in these parts. Well, it wasn't. Is there treasure here? I like treasure. 
while we're here, I will look for treasure, but I will also use the, uh, what's his name? Because sometimes there's stuff buried around these places. And I'm just going to double check while I'm here. Uh, now just a big old claymore. I don't have room for. But no, there is nothing buried here. So let's try over here. Um, yeah, they're just yip yapping, but I don't see any treasure. So, we're good there. But now i got to figure out what direction I was going. I cannot remember. I was headed... Not that way. I was headed behind me. Behind me, that direction. All right. There's that other tower there that I already did. There's the shrine. And I was headed kind of in this direction, I think. I may put down uh, some wood and some flame and make myself a fire so I don't have to fight things all night because it's already 8 p.m. and I really dislike fighting things in the middle of everything. All right. <laughs> All right, let's go down there. I don't know what's down here, but I'm here. So let's go see what's around. Why not? Oh, there's a bad good guy there. It's going to shoot me. That's okay. I can get behind this and then I will kill him. I'll just let this go and I will get this because he's just... There we go. Let's see if I can get him. Ha <laughs> ha! Got him. Ha <laughs> ha! All right. Let's take a look. There's got to be some maybe... I haven't been here before that I know of. I don't remember this area ever. There's a treasure chest here. Is there anything else around here besides a treasure chest? Hmm. Um, so we'll go over here and we'll get the chest. And then we'll take a look around. You can always use money. And that is money. Now, are there bad guys around here? Yeah, I would say that's a bad guy. Yeah. Haha, <laughs> I got him too. Nice. That was pretty easy, I have to say. So we'll go up top and see if we can get, if there's any other guys up here. Probably. If there's one, there's usually more than that. Um, ooh, and a soldier's boat too. Nice. So we're going to fly over here. Like I said, I'm, oh, crap, there is a Lizalfos there too. Ah, oh, this is not good because I'm dying. I'm not able to climb. I wonder if I can make it just keep track trying to climb. Yeah, I did too. Ha <laughs> ha! Sweet! And I'll kill this guy. Oh, that was really fast. Are there any other guys? There's lots of stuff glittering in the water, so... And I got another bow. Yay. So, is there more Lizalfos around here? Let's take a look. I don't see any here. But if there is any, they're going to be over, maybe over here? Hmm. I don't remember this place at all. But, it does have a lot of glittery stuff, so I'm going to say we probably got all the Lizalfos. I would say so. All right, let's go take a look and see what's glittering. Those are just acorns. And let's put this on. Oh, there's a sword there. That's, I don't know what that is. It's just a sword. We don't need it right now. So let's wander around, see if there's any treasure chests or anything buried. Let's see, anything in there? No. Anything in there? Nope. Alright. That's a, that's a sword. So I'm sure there's something here, because they wouldn't put the Lizalfos guarding stuff if there was nothing here. So there has to be a treasure of some kind. So let's 
So we'll just keep looking. I'm sure there's something here. Oh, that looks like a treasure chest. Woohoo. Oh, it's an X, it's an EX treasure chest. Sweet. Midna's helmet. A helmet much like the one Midna wore and when she fought along the Hero of Twilight. It's rather rare find. Now, I've heard of the Twilight Princess. My kid has the game. And we recently finished Wind Waker. So I will consider playing that game, maybe. Maybe that would be a game to play down the road here. Because, I mean, we're doing Skyward Sword and Breath of the Wild, but we did just finish Wind Waker. I think that's it. So now i got to figure out where I was going. So just a sec. Wrong way. No. So I need to go that way. No, I don't need a capture taken. <laughs> All right. Some of us have problems with buttons. All right. Don't be such a smart boot. She laughs at me all the time because I get lost all the time. Ugh. And I do get lost all the time, I admit it. Oh, good heavens. More of these guys. Ugh. These dudes are everywhere. Well, let's try climbing up here and see where we are. I know it's very frustrating for people watching this because they're like, where the hell are you? And I'm like, I don't know. Um, I'm lost. Sorry, where the heck are you? So I will get up to the top here and we'll take a look around and see if I can find the tower I supposedly was headed towards. <sighs> Because I do get lost so frequently. All right, so I saw a tower. I know I saw a tower. There it is. Is that it there? Yeah, that's it there. Oh, there's two. One there and one there. <gasps> Look! What is this? Oh, this looks like fun. Let's go find it. There's usually a couple of uh, shrines around a tower, too. Close to the bird. Like, the bird is over there. Oh, we got the bird. Did we get the bird? Yeah, because I had to get the clothing. I did the... Oh, look at all this stuff. What is this? It's some kind of a... This is the Jido Bridge? I don't know what this is. Oh, listen. It's... It's gas. He's playing his music some. Oh, there he is. There he is. I see him. All right. What are all these little needle eye things? They look like little needles holes in rocks. All right, Cass, tell me what this is all about. Tell me, tell me. Because I don't remember. Hello. Oh. I did not hear your approach. I was lost in the song written by my late teacher. Betcha I'm your late teacher. He passed away several years ago, you see, and this was the last song he taught me. Mm. Excuse me, I fear I may have gotten carried away. Nostalgia will do that to a person. I know a song about this place. Would you like to hear the ancient verse passed down in this region? Sure. Ooh. Excellent, without further ado. You, you talk like I do, Cass. When a single arrow threads two rings, the shrine will rise like birds on wings. A single arrow threads two rings. So you have to shoot an arrow through two? You think the rings in the song refer to these oddly shaped rocks? And what of the shrine? Mm. There is a mystery to be uncovered here, that's for sure. And I get the feeling the truth is beyond my wildest imagination. May light illuminate your path. Live long and prosper. I can't do it with my left hand, but all right. I can do it with my right hand. Live long and prosper. All right. So we got to figure out which rings you can thread two at a time with. Obviously not that one. Let's take a look. This one. Where? Oh, there's a bunch over there. All right. Maybe over here. 
Can I do two over here? That one looks kind of like one you could maybe do with, the middle one, over to there. Or it won't go up enough, but maybe over to that side. Or maybe I could go up. Yeah, that won't work. We'll try this one up here. Hmm, I don't know. I'm a little stumped, guys. I gotta figure this one out. There's gotta be one here that you could thread. Obviously not that one. Because I don't think you can... Well, maybe. I don't think so, though. I think it'd be pretty hard to do because you'd be falling off the rock. So that's not it. Um, this one? I think you gotta... It's got to be one with a rock here, but which one? Oh, wait a minute, there's a there's one over there. I wonder if you can go from there up to here. Um, all these little rocks hidden in behind these little rocks, it's a bit of a pain. I wonder if I can get one to go through there and that one over there. Let's see, can I do it? Now, let's see can't really see, so no, that's not really working. All right, so maybe if I, if I kneel, maybe I can do it. No. Oh, so close. No, down just a little. Oh, it worked! Holy cow! I'm going over and getting my my arrows too. Holy cow. It, there's only like wow. Shrine I didn't even remember about like what do I gotta do in this shrine? Holy cow, I've already had to shoot arrows. It's gonna be something. So let's go see if there's any arrows that I dropped over here when it hit. Did any of them survive? Well, one of them did. Any other ones? Oh! Yes, down there. There's a bunch of them. All right. Got them. All righty. So now, Shim Dagoza. Dagoza Shrine? Dagoza Shrine? Shim Dagoza. It's a shame to goes. <laughs> it's a shame to goes. I don't want to goes. But I was headed for that tower. See what I mean about this game? You get sidetracked. It's crazy side problems here. So, what am I looking at? What in the world? To you, sets in the foot of this right now. I am Shim de Goes. In the name of the goddess Hylia, I offer this trial. All right, moving in parallel. What is this? What is this? Oh. Oh. Do I go over here again? Uh-oh. What the? What do I do? What do I do? What do I do? <gasps> oh! You just walk back and forth? That's it? Well, I guess you had to figure out how to get here in the first place. Now my question is, where's the treasure? There's always a treasure in these places. Where is it? Where is it, people? Well, it's not over there. Is it in behind dude here or something? No? All right, I'm stumped. Where's the treasure? That's Bizarro. Where's the treasure? Um, it's got to be here. You can't not have a treasure. All right, um, no clue. No clue where the treasure is. It's gotta be over there. That's gotta be, you've gotta be able to fly over there. That's gotta be something over there. It's gotta be, cause there's a, a what's his name, pedestal here. Ah, yes, see? Aha! So where is, Ah, there's the treasure. Look at that! I knew it had to be there. Oh, a great thunder blade. You betcha I'm taking that. I don't care what I gotta toss for that one. I want the great thunder blade. Well, we'll toss you because I've been using you. So, 
Or did I have one that was broken? Okay. Uh, yes, I did. So I'm going to toss this guy and take the other one. And then, yeah, that one was better. Yeah, equip that. All right, and now we just wait for the other dude to come back. Sometime in the next 20 minutes, yes? Whew. There had to be, there had to be a treasure. They always have a treasure. This one was a little tougher to find. I do not remember this shrine at all. Maybe I never got this shrine in my first game. I don't know. But I don't remember it at all. How very weird. Hmm. Obviously you just run back and forth. And now I can leave. Hello, dude. Hey, dusty dude. Give me a thing of me. Yes, yes, resourcefulness. Yes, we know. Symbol. Yep. Or I just need one more and then I can get two more thingy parts. So. Yes. Ah, we got him. Woohoo. All right. So now I will not get sidetracked. We will go to the next tower. Um, the next tower, I believe, I'm trying to remember, it was this way. It was over towards the road. And I think I go up. What the? Is it already nighttime? <laughs> Using the wrong thing again. How to use the correct... <sighs> that Skyward Sword has me so confused. Alright, so I'm going over to the road up here. Um... Up there. I think it's up this way. Yeah, I'm going up. Going up. Okay, so we're going to come back to this one. What I'm going to do is, number one, change this to a different sword. And then we're going to go and get that tower. And that'll be how we end this. Takes a bit to get this tower. This is the tower. Oh, no, 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 no. No, I'm not doing the Thunder Plateau right now. Sorry, dude. Not happening. More spirits have settled in their proper places. They will guide you to a hero's trial. Yeah, I'm not doing it right now. I'm going to get that... Uh, oh, crud. I have... Um, I have uh, an electric... Oh, no, I have that on. I have that on. Oh, no, that's not good. We'll put that on for the moment. And the shield. I'm safe. So, I'm not doing that. We're going towards the tower. But the problem is, to get up to the tower, you got to climb up that hill. So it's going to take a few minutes. Tamsin will speed this part up. Because I have to run through here. All right, so there's the tower I want to go to. That's the tower I want to get. And if, it, if, I, if I'm correct, it is the one in the loop of, of uh, bad guys. I think I'm correct here. It's it's got a like a moat around it. Yeah, that's the one. And I find this one particularly difficult to get. So this is what I do. I I don't even go near the tower to get it. Just like that other one that I flew down into. This one you can try to fly down into, but it's not as simple as that because you can't get onto anything high enough to fly down to it. So what you're doing is just trying to avoid certain things, that's all. But I'll get there in a second and I'll show you what I'll do. And then once we get this tower, that's where we'll leave it. And next time when we come into this game, 
we will go and do the Thunder Plateau and go back and do the Colosseum because they're kind of fun to do. Well, the Colosseum, I know I'm pretty boring in there. Because believe it or not, I kill that thing with just bomb arrows. It takes a while, but it's actually quite worth it. It's, you can kill them and get the stuff in the Colosseum, and just using bomb arrows, you can get the stuff you need. But then you need to buy a bunch of bomb arrows. Now see, here we are pretty much at the top of the hill. What we're gonna do before we get into the tree to fly down, because it's the tree, this doesn't help you. If you go further back, it doesn't help you to get up there or get to them, because I've tried. And being on top of the hill doesn't really help. However, there are some rocks, I believe, up here. Is there or not? Yes, over here. I want the rocks, because there's a good one here. So I wanna, we'll just use this, this'll do. Sweet, I got some sapphires. That is nice. This doesn't always happen that way. So, if you try to fly to the tower from, where is the tower? Why can't I see it? Must be on the wrong side. If you try and fly to the tower from here, it doesn't do you any good. You drop too low. So what I do is I pick the tallest tree I can get and they aren't very tall. And if this, no, before you do this, my suggestion is you save, because if you mess it up, you just go back to the tree. So, and we're gonna try, and what you do, make sure you push your sights up, because for some reason, if you push your sights up, you fly higher, just a little bit, but, it's something to do with the, I guess, with the, the way they've made the game. But if it looks like you're going to fly into the bad guys, which are underneath, which will kill you really, really well, really fast, then you can just jump back to the A button. But you see how low I'm going? You really have to be quick in this one to get this. It's not easy. You have to get over top of everybody and you have to jump like Sting. Because those what's his name guys get you. The the electric guys. You gotta try and hide from the electric guys, and then you gotta jump. Because they will send electricity at your bum. And you will zap and die. But see, you can actually fly above them. And you see, they're shooting up towards me. So I need to jump higher faster. And that's why I always get lots of stamina and have the extra stamina stuff. Because they are shooting at me, the electric guys. And down in there, there's Lizolfo swimming around. It is not an easy tower to get. I hate this tower. However, I figured out how to do this. So, oh look, there's the dude for flying game. I like the flying game. It's fun. Sheikah Tower activated. Ooh. Mm -hmm. So, there we go. We've got this, we're good, we got this. We'll play the flying game and then that's it for today. So, we've got the tower. Excuse me for hiccuping. And we have the map. There we go. Map of the area. So we've got that next piece. So I think now all we're missing is sort of the, the deserty regions. The really cold and the desert. Those are the two like that we're missing. So where is the dude? There's the dude. Let's talk to dude. Hello, dude. It's quite high. If only I was a bird man. What? Where did you come from? Don't scare me like that. How did you get up here? Though I suppose you, I, you could ask me the same question. You see, I have dedicated my life to the study of birdmen. Their flight mechanics fascinate me. 
Given their weight, it should be physically impossible for them to fly on the wings of their size. I just don't get it. I was standing on the ground watching the skies when suddenly this tower erupted beneath my feet. I've been stuck up here since with no way to get down. But my misfortune is a blessing in disguise. You see, this tower is the perfect place to observe birdmen in their natural habitat and starve. Oh my, now you've climbed up here. How will you get down without falling? I suppose you're stuck here too. What? You can fly? Is it true? I thought it impossible for Hylian to fly like a birdman. Ah, it's more like gliding then. That's still a step in the right direction. If I can analyze your glide distance trajectory, it may help us understand science of birdman flight. And then maybe one day I'll finally realize my dream of becoming a bird. <laughs> All right, would you mind participating in a short research study? I want to see how far you can glide. You'll be compensated for your time and travel depending on how far you fly. So how about it? <laughs> Marvelous. Our findings today may prove to be the cornerstone of Birdman research for generations to come. However, you are merely gliding, not flying, making this a rather dangerous research project. And such, it's such a liability fee of 20 rupees will be necessary to proceed. You know, in case I have to file an incident report. All right. Landing, elevation, wind direction, stamina usage. Keep all of these in mind as you consider the farthest destination you can reach by gliding. Ah. If you're ready, let's take to the skies. Birdman research study go. <clears throat> all right. Uh, okay. <laughs> We're gonna go this way, because why not? We're doing okay. Oh, right, there's a shrine underneath me, too. I've forgotten. Somewhere down here, there's a shrine. But that's not gonna bother me right now, because right now I'm just gliding through all these rocks. I think. Oh. Uh, oh no! I don't want to hit anything. Oh, I'm good. <laughs> I thought I may hit it. Alright, so now we're going to turn this direction past there. Let's see how far we can get. How far can we get? We're not doing badly, you know, guys. We're at like 600. 636 meters. That's not bad. Not bad. I did okay. <clears throat> Alright, dude. Talk. Hello. Hello. Oh, there you are. <laughs> Marvelous! What a breathtaking flight! I never dreamed a Hylian could fly. 636.9 meters. Your methods may have been unconventional. I didn't see you flap your wings, but they were effective. The field of Birdman research will benefit greatly from this data. You deserve heavy compensation for your stellar efforts. Please take this. 100 rupees. I'll take it. So, if you're still up for it, why not glide down again? Nope, I'm good. Okay, but please come back soon. It's very boring up here. And I'm starving, so you know. Alright, well, there we go, guys. I think we're good for today. I'll just save this. There we are. So here we are. We, this is where we're going to save for today. Um, we've gotten a couple of towers. Uh, I've almost died a couple times, but that's okay. I fought some things, got some blue guys, some chew jelly and stuff. So all in all, not a bad hour. Anyways, um, this is Nana for Fun saying go outside, play a game, have some fun, play basketball, maybe badminton or tennis. Um, you know, if you live in the southern regions, go sledding if there's snow for you. Because I know on the other side of the world, they're having their winter as we're finishing off our summer. Um, you know, knit, play a game, like I said before, a video game or a board game, a card game, any of those. But really, have fun. It's super important that you enjoy your life and have fun. Um, if you really enjoy my videos, or even just to help me out, hit the subscribe button. I would love that. In any case, we'll see you again soon. Bye-bye.